Hi, Gemini's. So I'm going to be doing your reading. Oh, by the way, this is Dream Fear 444. I'm sorry for not introducing myself. Thank you guys for visiting my channel. And I want to do a reading for you guys um, today. I have to say um, that <clears throat> in the pre-shuffle, I kept getting the sword and the rose. So there is some type of clarity, some type of revelation that is coming um towards you some information that's coming to light and i was also seeing uh, where there was like a new phase so there may be a revelation that comes to light some information that comes to light gemini that pushes you into a new phase um there could be some new romance that is blossoming once um this information is revealed um looks like you may be looking to speak with someone um you and someone may be mirroring each other so these are these are the messages i was getting before um, your actual reading here. All right, so let's go into your reading. Gemini. Holy Spirit, show me what I need to see for Gemini. I keep getting this card in, in a lot of um, readings. So Gemini, there may have been someone who felt stabbed in the back. Um, so there's a bit of heartbreak. Um, in pain because of some type of deception or someone feeling like they were deceived here. Now, this may have been something that was definitely not expected um, by the person at all. Like, you didn't see this coming here. And there is some type of a snake um, in your midst, Gemini. Someone who is competing with you or someone who may, you know, may portray themselves to be a friend, but they are definitely an enemy so you may be having to look over your shoulder now this could also be some other woman so this could be a third party situation here but there is someone who is very malicious gemini so you want to be careful here now i did see the mirroring and it's back out here on the table so it could be that you um and someone else are mirroring each other um this could be uh, some type of twin flame situation or just you're dealing with some wounds and someone else is also. So you guys are definitely looking at each other and um, it's like looking in the mirror. You're seeing you're seeing the negative traits in them that are also in you. And so those are the areas in Gemini in which you yourself um, may need to look at and work on for your own personal healing. So Gemini also, I do see where there is someone is very heartbroken. This could be you. Being deeply hurt and, and sad by a separation or some type of breakup. Now, if there hasn't been a separation or a breakup, this could be you or someone grieving a loss. Um, feeling, um, yeah, feeling grief or mourning. Um, some type of loss. So, so if you have lost someone, I send you my condolences at this time. Now, others of you who have not dealt with a physical, you know, death, you may be dealing with heartbreak because of separation or breaking up from someone. Now, I do see where there has is separation here. So someone did, um, has separated and someone is missing the other or you both are missing each other, but you're very unsure of the future. So there's a lot of sadness around your uh, situation right now. Now, there, there um, is some type of, un there's an unconditional love here, whether it's between you and this person you're separated from, um, or if this is something that's to come in the future, there's definitely an unconditional love here, and someone may be possibly falling in love with someone else, I'm not sure, but I'm just um, going by the, the different scenarios, we all have different situations going on here, I do see Cupid's arrow, so love is coming, um, Gemini. So if you're looking for love, you're waiting for love after some heartbreak, it is coming. And that's where that unconditional love and that falling in love could be, um, we, we could be seeing here. So you may have separated from someone else. It could have ended in heartbreak and there could be new love coming in. I did see, um, like a new phase in the pre-shuffle here. So, um, you may have found yourself in a karmic relationship um, and you may be feeling um, that it's time to let it go if you haven't already. You're focused on yourself. You've learned the lessons from this karmic relationship and you're ready to move on. It has been very triggering to you. There's, it has caused a lot of turmoil and heartbreak and you're ready to move on to meet someone new. Um, you have date on here. So date 
meeting someone new, you're setting up plans. Some of you are getting back out there into the dating world to find love. Now, you also have the Grim Reaper here. So there is a relationship that is over. There is no second chances. Um, and you're looking to grow and transform your life. So either you or someone else has decided that you're not willing to give this relationship a try. You're ready to move on to something else. And even though it hurts, you feel that this is the best thing for you or someone else feels like it's the best thing for them. So let's continue on Gemini. Let's see what else is out here for Gemini. Okay. Yeah, Gemini, you or someone else may have felt that you were not getting enough in the relationship. Someone was very frustrated. Um, someone may have been lacking the confidence in the relationship as well. There may have been a lot of jealousy here. Um, and someone may have just been very fearful, maybe insecure and just in their ego. And it caused the relationship to go left. Now we have photographs. So you may be looking at someone's photos and someone may be looking at yours and they're missing you. So there's a lot of nostalgia here and you're looking to... Um, you may be looking to return to someone new. You, um, not new, but looking to return to someone from your past by looking at this photograph um, card. This could be you going in a different direction to someone, someone else. Or you're just looking to make new memories with someone new here, Gemini. But definitely love is here for you. Definitely have faith because it's coming. You're going to have some type of an invitation or some type of meeting with someone. And... Um, this could be the start of a very new, beautiful, you know, romance for you, Gemini. And you deserve it. Um, after going through the heartbreak and, and healing, definitely you deserve new love. It's coming for you. Um, but do keep in mind that there is a snake out here, Gemini. There is a snake. So be careful that someone does not try to sabotage um, your new relationship. You want to be very careful and make sure that all doors are closed to the past before you open a new one. Now, we also have healing heart. So you are healing from a heartbreak. You're removing yourself from toxic situations. And you're also, if you have been battling any addictions, you're removing yourself um, from those addictions and those in maybe even codependent ways and you're um, looking to for stability you're looking for something that's permanent you're no longer seeking temporary um, thrills but you're looking for something that's going to be um, provide growth in your life Gemini and that's beautiful I love that now you have coffee cup here so you will be meeting and speaking with someone you will be um Meeting someone new or like I said, you could possibly reconcile with someone from the past who you were having this nostalgia with. Um, you guys could start off with a new friendship and just begin to just uplift one another, Gemini. And that's what you need right now. You need a friend more than anything. Um, yeah, and we have cameras. So you are reminiscing um, because you've learned from the past. You're looking to take those lessons and move into a new direction with someone new. Okay. So, Gemini, I know that um, you may have had a heck of a journey. It's been painful. It's been difficult. But you are on your way to a new beginning. And, I, and I'm so happy for you. And it doesn't matter whether you were, you know, you, we're not all good here. We make mistakes here. But, Gemini, the fact is you've learned the lessons and you're ready to move in a new direction. And I'm so happy for you. So, I'm going to go ahead and get some advice for you, Gemini. This is beautiful. I mean, it's painful at the same time. Like I said, for those of you who have lost um, someone, I do send you my condolences. There is a new beginning that's coming for you. Um, you will meet your soulmate when the time is right. So Gemini, those of you that have gone back out into the dating scene, looking to meet someone new, you're going to meet your soulmate when the time is right. Focus on yourself. Focus on your healing. Focus on you and what you need to do for you so that you can come correct um the, when you do you know meet this new person you also have life is art paint your dreams sing your songs enjoy the dance so gemini it's time for you to get back out there and enjoy your life it's time for you to, to live lighthearted. don't you know don't be so worried you know about the things of the past allow yourself to heal but also allow yourself to have fun enjoy life enjoy you know just this new beginning that's coming. You're finding yourself. You're finding out what it is that you love. You're not allowing anybody to come into your life and control you or rule over you. Um, Gemini, you are heading in the right direction. And I am so proud of you. All right now. So, Gemini, that is your reading.
I look forward to seeing you on the next one. I will be posting another Gemini reading for you very shortly. So I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.